friends, it's Sydney from Sid Plants It Out. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. Today I'm going to be, sorry, I'm trying to cover up that light glare. Um, today I'm going to be doing my December monthly budget. Um, hopefully I can actually make sense this month. Last month when I was trying to do this, it just, I wasn't, I wasn't making any sense and I couldn't do it and it was a struggle. So we're going to hope that I can actually make words that make sense this month, um, unlike last month. So <laughs> um, I pulled out gray boxes because I feel like gray is like a nice neutral. It kind of reminds me of like winter and like, you know, it's, it's gonna be winter, so sadly and it's December so yeah and then I also have this budget sticker book um, and I'm gonna use some from out of here I do need a piece of paper which I don't have any in that planner so let me find a piece of paper that's not a piece of paper let's just use one of these why not these, this is filler paper that came in a notebook, I believe, from uh, the Valentine's Be Happy box. So it has like pink dots on it. It's cute. And I like this. You got this. That's, that's a good message for budgeting, right? I think so. All right. Let's start off with um, boxes. So um. Let's decide what color I want. Ooh, that one's so like, you can't even see that. <laughs> Do I want this one or this one? I think I like this one. So I'm going to pull out all the boxes. How many do I need? So many, I feel like, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That's a lot. It's a lot of boxes. I might regret this. Maybe we'll do for each paycheck. I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do. Let's let's just start at the top here. So I have rent due. Oh my gosh, what a good start. A crooked box. Gracious Lord in heaven. All right, I think that's straight now. Whatever, we're going with it. So <laughs> I have rent and Patreon on the first. On the second, we have iCloud and Discover. I was like, what else? I don't know. Um, let's see, the seventh is Netflix. And then nine, there's my car payment and something else. Oh, a credit card. I was like, uh, what else? Um, let's see. And then on the 12th is Spotify. And then now I'm trying to decide, do I wanna change colors? Or do I just want to stick with this color? I think I'm just going to stick with this color. All right. So Amex is due there. And then I was thinking maybe I would use like two separate colors, but we're, we're just going to keep it simple. We're just going to use one color box. Keep my life a little bit easier. And Spectrum and Kindle and Hulu which, you know, probably not gonna go through in that day since it's Christmas Eve and also a Saturday. But we'll put the box there. <laughs> That's when it's actually due. And then, I don't know what that is, Evergy. I was like, mm, I don't know. And progressive. There's literally no rhyme or reason to why I put the boxes where I put them. Like in the box, I just, I was just going for it. <laughs> it's kind of, it's kind of where I'm at. And then I'm gonna take, I don't know if I need that big of a box or if I could just use one of these. I don't know if this is enough lines. Hmm. I don't know, we'll come back to it. 
Okay, so my paydays, you can see, are kind of weird now. So it like throws off my brain on how to do this. But I think I might have figured out a way to make it make sense for my brain. We'll see. We'll see. But I think I might have figured it out. So this book has all of these bullets in the back here, right? So what I was thinking was I would pick two colors. Yeah, at least two. Maybe we'll come back for that one. But um, pick a couple colors and then like mark that on the payday. So if I could get the bullets out of the book, that would be very helpful. Are you being serious right now? All right, we're just, we're just gonna, we're, we're gonna take this out of here. Maybe that'll make my life easier. I just want the bullets. These like aren't cut right, I guess. I don't, I don't understand. Maybe there's a reason I haven't used all of them. Good Lord. Okay, so this payday will be associated to that color. So now what I need to do is go back to my November budget so I can figure out <laughs> what's getting paid with this and what is not. So this will be paid with this paycheck. And what I'll do is I'll go through and so we'll do Patreon and then I'll put a box and the box will be the bill has been paid. And then this, when I like have the money for it, I can check that off to help my brain kind of function. Because I liked, like, I like having the, the two boxes to denote like, because what I do is I separate, let me, let me take a breath here. So <laughs> because I get paid twice a month, I take each paycheck and I take part of like, you know, half of each bill. Um, that's like a bigger bill. Half of each of those is paid from like the two paychecks before that bill is due to an extent. There has been a little bit of like moving around because my paydays have changed, but to an extent, there's like two different ones that are paying it. So I want to denote that there's like two different ones with two different bullets, but I also want a box that's like, ah, uh, this has been paid. It has gone through my account, it is paid. Versus just like, yep, I put the money away. Like, oh, did I ever actually pay it? I don't know. So this is my thought for this month. We will see how this goes. So then for rent, there won't be any colored bullets because that money for rent is gonna come from my two paychecks. So my end of December or end of October paycheck and then my mid-November paycheck. That's kind of how I have worked this out. So yeah, I think if you like see it written out, it'll make more sense, but uh, we'll see. So then for Discover, um, I paid half of it with my mid-November paycheck, so my uh, 1115 paycheck. So all I have left is half that I have to pay from this paycheck. And then for iCloud, this is a smaller amount. It's like $3. So it will come out of this paycheck only. I feel like this is so confusing to describe every single time I do it, but I really do my best to try to make it make sense. I don't know if I make it make sense, but I try. So then we have Netflix. And this will be with, maybe I should just write all of them in first. That might be easier. So then we have city <clears throat> because all I'm writing is just what the bill is. And then a box for if it's been paid. 
And then I'll use the bullets to like kind of try to like visually categorize it for myself. Like this is one thing I've realized is like money is very, it's very much like a visual thing. Like I guess making it a visual thing makes it make more sense for me. Um, <clears throat> which is why I, I like the concept, the idea of using cash for like cash spending. It's just very hard for me because I feel like so many things that I want to buy are online. You know, anybody else have that struggle where you're just like, well, I want to use cash, but I want to buy all the online things. And I know what I need to do is just like go to, um, I need to like go to the bank if I want to buy that thing. And then that would make me not um, overspend because I would actually have to get my butt up and go um, to the bank. This bill will, again, just be, be just like rent where it will be all of the money will come out from my paychecks before this one. So I don't need one there. And then that one goes there. And then also, let's see, that one will go here. Sorry, I'm like looking at my November monthly because I wrote it all out in my November monthly. And now I'm like doing this again in my brain and my brain is like, what did you write? What are you doing? Lord only knows if I'm being honest. <laughs> okay, so part of this one, because that's a bigger bill. And then I guess I could really just like do this with my brain, huh? I don't really need something to look at. It just makes me feel better. That one. This one. And that one. Okay, so then this payday, let's do, let's do this pink. I want them to be like really different. So, but like still coordinate, you know, because why not make it pretty? <laughs> so this will be paid here. And then part of this one, like the other half of that bill this bill. I hope this makes sense. Every time I explain it, I just really feel like it doesn't make sense, but I'm doing my best to try to make it make sense because I feel like it could be helpful. It's been a lot of trial and error, honestly, to try to figure this out, but I feel like it could be helpful to someone else who is trying to figure out how to make their every other week budget work because I feel like, you know, people get paid a lot of different ways and I feel like getting paid every other week or, you know, twice a month, something like that is pretty common, at least in my experience. So I feel like sharing this could make this make sense for people. Um, I'm going to, I still don't know if I need this big of a box. I guess I would need to figure out that one. I guess I need to figure out what this is gonna pay. So, uh, I need a January calendar. <laughs> I was like, uh, oh no, I don't have a January calendar next to me anywhere. Oh gosh, you guys, uh, here we go. I'll just, I'll just use my phone. I'll just use my phone. Why that took me so long to figure out Lord only knows. All right. So for January, hopefully nobody texts me anything. <laughs> but for January, so I'll get paid on the 13th because the 15th is a Sunday. So we'll get paid on the 13th. So everything from like the 1st through the 13th will have to be paid with this paycheck and then 
everything after. Yeah, this is this is where it gets complicated, I feel like, is because I'm trying to explain the future. I'm gonna use this in the sidebar over here for those things that are gonna get paid. And I'm going to choose on different color for that. So, um, yellow? Why not? All right, so this payday, now we're gonna write in, it feels really repetitive probably if you're looking at this because I'm just like rewriting everything that's in here for the month, but it's helpful to my brain to figure out what I'm doing, you know? Like, I don't know, maybe that's just me, but it helps my brain. So we will start with rent and rent will be, I guess I don't need a box, do I? I could just do this for these. Okay, that makes sense because I just need to know that I've put the money. I don't need to like, I can mark it, I paid it in my January monthly. Okay, okay, I'm making this make more sense for myself as I go along. So <laughs> rents, so this will be, I guess above this, let's write um, 1230 paycheck. Cause that's kind of what I'm trying to make happen here without having like, you know, January on here. But I need this like visually so that I know what else I need to pay. I really hope that makes sense. I'm really not sure that it does, but I'm trying. <laughs> um, let's see. I, I need, where did my other page go? Sorry, I like have pages to the side here and I keep losing them. All right, there we go. So rent, oh, I forgot Patreon. Whoops. So Patreon, rent, discover, iCloud will get paid with that one. And then Netflix. And then let's see. Um, city, ally, Spotify. So that's where I'm going to start for this adventure in my brain as I throw my pen on the ground. Actually, it didn't make it to the ground, luckily, but you know. All right. So with this paycheck, I will pay part of this bill because that would be like, those are the two bills now that I'm working on. Those are the two paydays that I'm using for this now. And then the other part of it will come out of this paycheck. And then let's see if I could, there we go. Um, no, no, part, okay, so part of this one part of this one and then the rest of them will be just with the December 30th paycheck. Like this all is very visual because I am a very visual person and it just, it really helps me figure out what the heck I'm doing because sometimes I feel like the hardest part is just like visually trying to figure out, okay, where do I need to put the money? Where is the money gonna go? All right, so there's those. And then also with this paycheck, I'll put money away for like the bills that are later in the month. So like I did here where I have like, whoops, out of frame, sorry. <laughs> so like here I have this paycheck is paying all of these things, but then also it's paying parts of these in order to keep up with the halvesies kind of thing. 
if that makes sense. I'm still not sure that it does, but that's okay. So I realized that I messed this up actually because this paycheck, I will put money away. Hold on, I have it written down. <laughs> January, January, yeah, so actually there won't be any, I really want this bullet out of here. I just, I gotta be honest with you. Ha ha, I got it. So for this rent payment, it's going to be from that paycheck and then that paycheck since I don't get paid until the 30th. And then this one I believe is on the same schedule just for my brain, honestly. Um, it, it's just how I, like, I got ahead and I would like to stay ahead because you never know what's going to happen. So you might as well stay ahead on that. Pretty sure that's right, yeah. So you can see here, I went through at the end of Jan uh, October, I was like, what the heck month is this? And I like wrote out all of these paychecks so that I would know like, where is everything going? Where am I taking the money from? That kind of thing to help my brain. So then we have, let's see, January, January, um, December. Yeah. Okay. I'm just making sure that I have everything coinciding with what I have already written for, you know, helping to make things make sense in my brain. All right. The next things. So this, so then we need to do Spectrum, Hulu, Evergy, and Progressive. So Spectrum, Hulu, Evergy. Progressive. So here you see that these bills are being paid half by this paycheck and half by this paycheck. So it's going to be like the same concept. Half of all of these ones will be paid by this paycheck and then the other half will be paid with the paycheck on the uh, 13th, which actually is probably gonna be a little bit of a smaller paycheck. So I might have to do a little bit of finagling with um, some stuff, but that's okay. It will not be the end of the world. I have savings to like, you know, that I could take and then replenish once I get more. That's kind of how I am making this work for my brain. All right, let's put, because I took this sticker book out, let's just find, yep, this one right here kind of matches my color scheme. So we're gonna use it. And we're just gonna put this up here because motivational quotes are always welcome here. All right, so now we have everything here. And then I have written out everything. So I'm trying to decide, but I think I want to puts like November and December and the beginning of January on this page. So it will be some repetition of work that I've already done, but I'm okay with that personally. So I'm going to do it. Also, just because I'm feeling extra, let's go ahead and put a bullet here too. Why the heck not? Like we'll, we'll label these with the bullet. I cannot believe that this year is almost over. I'm sorry. I just had to get that in here. Like I cannot. How did we get here? How has this happened? I think I'm going to do this up here. 
So these will be, so 1130 and then 1215, I forgot the one. <laughs> and then we'll do a yellow for that one, 1230. We'll do it like, uh, like here. And then we'll just write 113. All right, so now I know based off of this, it's hard to keep like all of it in frame. Um, so I'm, th this is just gonna have to go a little bit out of frame. I apologize, but this paycheck I will pay Patreon, which is 30.01. And then I need my other page now that I was looking at because it has, oh, well, I didn't have all of these yet. I suck. <laughs> I didn't do the math that I thought I had done. What is my life? That's fine. <laughs> um, all right. And then again, we have rents, but it's going to be for January. So what I started doing was writing like, what month is this for? So that will pay December. And then we have rent, which I like to put away 550 from each paycheck and that will pay January's rent. And then we have discover and iCloud. So this is 92.50, I believe. That's what we're gonna go with. I can always white it out later, but so these will both be December. And then I'm pretty sure that's right. Yeah. And then we will pay Netflix for December. So Netflix for December, and then we'll pay City for December. And then Ally, we're going to put money away for, but it's going to be for January. So I guess I could write like, maybe I like put January here. I'm kind of shook that it's going to be January. Like, I'm just, I'm really, yeah, really not, not doing it. Um, yeah, it's, it's just crazy. I'm excited about new planners, although I'm not really changing up my planner lineup, but like new planners are always nice. New things are always nice. Anybody else? All right, so then we'll pay Spotify and that will be December. And then we'll skip over the ones that are just pink and we'll do, we have Spectrum, which I don't remember how much that is, 45. And a lot of these I round up just a little bit cause like, I think it was like 44.995 but like, I'm not gonna do that. And then I just like, it accrues into my account that I move. So I have, the way that I make this work for like, you know, these bills that are like auto pay and like, I don't even know if you can pay Hulu without it being on auto pay. So what I do for like bills like that is I will, um, I have another account that I move money to and that's what I'll do like when I get paid I'll leave the money or like pay the things that I can pay so either leave the money in my checking account for like you know for Patreon and iCloud and Netflix probably and then like Discover and City I'll pay those and then I'll move the rest of the money into my other account in order to make sure that I'm not spending it because it's just in another account that I try to just kind of avoid um, in order to make my life easier 
for myself and um, that money just stays there. And then if there's like, you know, I move 45, but it's really only I need 44.995 of it or whatever, then I just like that money adds up in that account as just a little bit extra. And then I have it as extra there. Okay. So that's what I would do. So that's words, words are not a thing. So that's what everything that'll be paid with this paycheck. Now this first December paycheck is going to pay Amex. So a hundred and that will be for December. And then we'll pay the other half of spectrum. So then like on, you know, like this week or whatever, I would, or even maybe that week, whatever, I would move the money back from my other account to pay for those things, which really it would just be that one because I can pay that one like when I get paid. But it's just of the visual thing really helps me a lot. And not having it in my account that I use all the time is also very helpful to make sure that I'm not just spending money because it's in there, you know? which I want to say I'm getting better at. It depends. <laughs> Sometimes I do great with it. Other times, not so much. So it's just a matter of really how strong-willed I am at that day. That's kind of what it comes down to. I'm working on it. It's we're, we're taking baby steps, making progress. Okay, so then we have, so that's all of the December, everything for December now is accounted for in those two paychecks. Then I'll account for the rest of these. So we have, <clears throat> I feel like I missed, oh no, I didn't. Okay. I was like, I feel like I missed something. Oh boy, my brain. All right, rent, and this will be for January. And then we have discover, which is also for January. So that's the pink one. Uh, I was like, how much is it again? I forget. My brain is mush. And then we'll skip those ones and we'll go to city, which is 50. And that's for January. <clears throat> and then Ally for January. Okay. That should be everything for that one. Yeah. And then for the 30th, we will pay into Discover. Um... So this will be the other half of what's due in January. And then Patreon. I guess that one could have gone first on the list, but I messed up over there. That's what it was. I was like, why? Why did I do that? Because my brain is kind of a struggle. I can't even form words. Dear God. All right. <laughs> And then we have Netflix. Um, yes, I was like, wait, did I do that right? I did. So that would be for January. And then City. Again, for January. I'm kind of regretting this paper decision just because the dot grid is kind of hurting my head. But I think it's just because I've been staring at it for so long. <laughs> goodness. All right. And then we'll pay Spotify, Whoa, which is $9.99. And that'll be January. So you see how this, it's all very repetitive and it's like the same things over and over, but it helps me to figure out like, okay, where, where is the things? What am I paying with all of my paychecks so that I know 
um, where the money is going, what I'm doing, all that good stuff. Uh, I was like, I forgot how much all of these are. Literally, my brain just said, nope. <laughs> this is why budgeting is hard, because math is hard. I hate math. I feel like I said this in a recent video, but math is literally like my least favorite thing. And then for this paycheck, what I would do is I would just do like, again, all of these things. So everything that's at the end of the month. So anything after the 13th. So it would be like, I could do it based off of this. So it would be Amex again, and then the rest of Spectrum, Kindle, I'm not going to write out everything on this one because, again, I'll probably do something like this where I write it all out again, but it's helpful. And I feel like at this point, you probably get where I'm going with this, uh, with what I'm writing here. And then again, I would have, so these would all be January. January, January, am I even in frame? Yes, okay. For a second, I was like, ooh, I feel like I'm kind of far away. And then we would have rent for February. So it would be just like this one. Oh, I missed rent. <laughs> Yikes! I missed two things here. I missed rent and ally. You guys, you're supposed to tell me these things. So we have, so I can then go back. I have rent for January have rent for January. So this will be for February. And then again, I see here I have, where is it? Ally for January, ally for January. So both of those will be February. And then that rent will be February. Ally will be February. Um, I think that's it. Oh, and city. I always forget that one too. February and discover. Lord help my soul. Or maybe my brain. I think it's my brain. All right. So then I would have, so these things for January, those things for February, but they all come out of that paycheck in order to ensure that I have the money that I need when things need to be paid. So then I would just go through and I would add this all up and I would keep the totals. And then when the paycheck comes, like if it's bigger or smaller, so like we had a paycheck in October that was bigger than we thought it was going to be because of a holiday and like we get paid differently now with our new comp like with our company having been acquired by a different company. So we get paid a little bit differently. So we got more money than we expected to get. So that's how I like got ahead on like having more for rent and more for ally and those things. And then I also got ahead on, um, uh, like I was able to pay, uh, I was able to put aside money for Christmas. I was able to pay on, um, some credit cards. I was able to like do things with that money, set up some sinking funds, all of those good things. So Maybe I don't want that there. I probably don't, honestly. I kind of want it here. <laughs> um, but yeah, so when I get paid, I'll just like be able to go back and um, be like, well, is there, you know, one of these that's bigger than the other? Can I like move something around? That kind of thing. I try to keep my budget, like obviously there are things that like are not flexible because, you know, like if that due date is coming up, that's not flexible. I have to pay that. But if there's something that like could move to a different paycheck or something like that, then I have that ability to be flexible because I have everything written out for like the next four paychecks. So <laughs> that's kind of how I do this. Um, I hope that was helpful a little bit. I personally think that the color coding that I have going on here is going to help my brain. And then also having the box to be like, yep, I paid that. Like, so like when I get paid here, I can put, you know, like whatever this money to the side and then like put an X or a check in there to like show like that money is put aside. And then 
when I get paid here, like I'll know that like I have that other money and then I can just like check it off when it's paid. I don't know. We'll kind of, it might be a little bit flex, uh, a little bit of a learning curve on how to do that, but that's kind of what I'm going for. So I hope this was helpful to you. Thank you for listening to me ramble about money and now I'm bad at math. Um, <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate if you gave it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope that you have a great rest of your day. If you want to see more of my videos, you can hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.